why was Jesus baptized? John the Baptist was performing a baptism of repentance, preparing sinners for the coming Messiah, right? He was a voice in the wilderness crying out, prepare the way of the Lord. So Jesus came up to John and he asked John to baptize him. But why? Why was Jesus baptized if he was sinless? And John was doing a baptism of repentance, by the way, to prepare people for the coming Messiah. Why was Jesus baptized? And Jesus told John, let it be so, so as to fulfill all righteousness. Jesus was being baptized to identify himself with sinners, not as a sinner, but as one who will become sin on our behalf, like 2 Corinthians 5.21 says, and one who bore our sins in his body on the tree, like Peter says. And Jesus, who became sin, who knew no sin through the crucifixion, dying on the cross, being baptized into our sins, immersed into our sins, he did that so that anyone who believes in him can become the righteousness of God. So a righteous act that Jesus needed to fulfill in order to be the candidate to be a perfect sinless sacrifice was water baptism. And he did this righteous act of baptism to show he's identifying with sinners. He's being immersed and baptized into our sins symbolically to show what is going to happen. And you think about obviously what baptism means. You're dying, being baptized, buried, and you're rising out of the water. And it all pictures the gospel, Jesus' death, burial, and resurrection. And so his baptism also displayed the triune nature of God. Remember when Jesus came up out of the water, it says the Holy Spirit descended upon him as a dove and in the form of a dove. And God the Father spoke from heaven saying, this is my beloved son with whom I'm well pleased. And so Christ's baptism started his ministry. Remember for 30 years, Jesus kind of lived in quiet obscurity. But then when he came and was baptized by John, this act of righteousness, it pictured the ministry that he was going to fulfill, which was the death, burial, and resurrection to accomplish salvation for sinners. And he was identifying with us sinners by being baptized into our sins, so to speak, when he would be crucified.